love it when I come across a garden that takes me by surprise with its inspiring design, thoughtful plant combinations and sheer beauty. Alloan Gardens in Victoria's Yarra Valley is just that, a breathtaking garden on a big scale. And the mastermind behind its creation is landscape designer John Vanderland. How do you go about creating a garden of this scale? Did, it, did you have it as a vision? Yes. We, we really bought the block of land with the idea of building a garden on it. It was always going to be a retirement project. Uh, being a landscaper, when you get older, we were hoping that the garden would be finished by then, so you could just sit back and enjoy it. And have you got to that phase yet? Fairly well. Not quite. <laughs> Do you have favourite areas of the garden? I think the archway <coughs> is still the favourite, uh, by far. In spring, it's just absolutely stunning. Uh, because it's Japanese wisteria, and the flowers are really long. Um, we've measured flowers up to 1.6 metres long, and so it's incredibly graceful. Then the, uh, the new French-inspired garden and the birch forest. The changes that occur there uh, all year, it's just magic to watch. So how do you go about interpreting the traditional you know, English perennial border to quite tough conditions, I guess? Oh, you, li you live and learn and we change it all the time. And, and the thing about the perennial border is that you can play with it. You, you try out different plants continuously. There's really fantastic plants come on the market all the time. So it gives you an opportunity to try them out and see what works in a tough environment. And this would be very colourful, I imagine, from spring right through to autumn? Oh, it really does flower all the way through. And, but you still get surprise elements. And, and autumn is always fantastic. This is a great example of how an edible garden can be both productive and beautiful. It's a fantastic space. Yeah, to be honest, the interesting part is that we originally actually designed it as a rose garden. Yeah. And then we decided that the edible garden that was part of the plan was going to be too far away, so we turned it and swapped it. The fruit trees, we're growing them in, uh, in avenues, so you can actually walk under the fruit trees in the shade during the summer months and all of the, the edible plants as such, which is medicinal, herbs, and the vegetables are all out in the full sun. Well, I tell you what, John, this is a very inspirational garden, so thank you so much for showing me around. And you can, of course, visit the garden at any time of the year. If you'd like to know more information on Alloan Gardens, just check out the website.